And District Attorney Bill Hicks says the prosecution team is ready to set a pre-trial date in the state's case against the Sierra Vista Walmart shooter. In case you missed our 10 o'clock newscast last night, our KTSM 9 News reporter Skylar Soto has a recap of yesterday's status hearing. The status hearing Thursday afternoon was for Judge Sam Medrano to hear from the prosecution and the defense to determine where the case is at and where it's headed. Judge Medrano says there will be another status hearing next month where he expects an update from both parties. In a full courtroom, District Attorney Bill Hicks addressed that the only new discovery is a ballistics report, surveillance from businesses, and videos from dash and body camera. The prosecution, which is D.A. Hicks' office, created a case portal system where they could make all evidence easily accessible. Although the prosecution said in part, quote, the problem in the case is there's so much shared discovery, end quote. The defense then said in part, quote, this is an issue of justice versus politics, end quote. The defense showed how an increase of files were submitted by the prosecution from November 2023 to now, and they feel as it's paper sabotage. The defense allegedly claims that the prosecution gave them a disc infected with a virus, adding that the prosecution is disorganized. The defense saying in part, quote, who's responsible for delay on this trial? Not the defense's fault, end quote. It's been my, my statement from the beginning that we're going to be moving this case forward as best we can, and we have. We've completed all the discovery, so we'll be back in February. I think we, we communicated to the court well what the situation was, that there's you know, obviously lots of discovery in this case. We got seven terabytes of discovery this month, over four and a half years later. Why does it take four and a half years for us to get the discovery? That's not our fault. That's not the judge's fault. That's the district attorney's fault. And it's simply because politics plays a role. The defense team telling reporters outside the courtroom that this is the largest case in the state and one of the largest in the country, and it has to be done right. D.A. Hicks also said in part, quote, the defense will never agree to what we want. That's their job. Their job is not to agree with what we want, end quote. Reporting in the El Paso County Courthouse, I'm Skylar Soto, KTSM 9 News. And the judge in this case says that he wants both parties to have a list of motions that they can file comfortably for the next status hearing. And as for a trial date, the judge says there are nowhere near setting one just yet.